In today's video, I'll be making the world of SpongeBob here in Brookhaven. We're gonna have buildings, cars, and tons more straight from the show. But before any of that, I challenge you to leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel in under three seconds. Three, two, one. If you are able to do that, write Sponge in the comments below and I'll try to leave you a little heart. Before we start making it, we'll go to the Roblox search bar and look for Brookhaven SpongeBob. Damn, there seems to be a ton of games like these. To be honest, this one feels kinda soothes. I found this one called Brookhaven Sponge. Whoa, it has almost 9k visits. It should be good then, right? We just logged into it and, dude. Oh, it's the paddy wagon from the movie. The first one where they go after King Neptune's crown. Can we drive it? Wait a minute, we actually can. This is so cool. It kinda just slides around, but it is pretty nice. Now, why is this rock in here? For no reason. Oh, it's probably one of those big corals that are around Bikini Bottom. Wait, what just happened? Did I just go into the ground? Dude, am I underneath the map? This is basically the back rooms of this place. Let me reset it. Oh, we started with a few items. To start, we have a Krabby Patty. Whoa, that's delicious. We got SpongeBob Coke. Never seen that before. Well, it has a unique taste. Wait, was that a burp? Then there's a flashlight and a glove light. This is from one of the episodes too. Very cool. Is this from an episode? Wait, no. This is from Friday Night Funkin'. Why is this in here? And here we have the Krusty Krab. The best restaurant in all of Bikini Bottom. Whoa, the gang's all here. Look at Squidward manning the cashier. Are you good? He isn't really much of a talker. At least this place is looking pretty nice. We can just sit down and order some food. Can we get into the kitchen? Oh, they don't let us do that. Okay, I guess. But SpongeBob is right over here. He must be focused on work. The sky's the SpongeBob one, of course. And don't worry, guys. My SpongeBob Brookhaven is gonna be even better than this one since we're gonna add a ton more stuff. Wait, what's that thing? It's right in front of the school. Is that supposed to be the boating school? Wait, is that SpongeBob? What's up, Bob? Can you give me your autograph? I'm a huge fan. He's such a cute little guy. But he doesn't look like he wants to talk. Thank you, Bob. Bob, this place does look like the boating school, but it literally doesn't let us get inside or anything like that. It's just decor. Let's have a last look around before it's my time to do it. Oh, I think that's SpongeBob and Patrick. Patrick is looking good, but Bob has seen better days. I don't think your arms and legs should look like that, buddy. That SpongeBob is straight from the dark web, but here we have SpongeBob's home. Squidward's right beside it, and right on top of here we have Patrick. Let's go up here and see if we can get into it. Now that one does look just like his house. These ones are more simple and done within game blocks. Inside Squidward's house there isn't much stuff, since we don't have much space. We can probably find some nicer models than this one. Here we have SpongeBob's house. Which still doesn't have much. At least we got Gary. But just kinda. Oh, there's this car right here. Whoa, this one's good. It's pretty damn fast. Very nice. Now it's time for us to modify our game. We'll be using Roblox Studio to edit and add things to the game. For example, we can just delete the fountain if we please. But we'll leave it there as we want to change some other stuff before that. Like this sky. We don't want it to be the regular Brookhaven one. We want something like this. This Spongebob one looks so good. And to start, we gotta go to the neighborhood and fill it with the houses that we have in the show. Of course. To start, we'll get Spongebob's house. Wait, why is this so gosh darn small? We'll have to make that a lot bigger. And it even came with the character too. That's so cool. Even though Bob is looking weird. Just look at his face. Here we also have Mr. Krabs with his eyes closed and Gary, the cute little guy. For now, I'll leave them there. If I find better ones, I'll delete them. But Bob's house looks pretty damn good. Right in front of the spawn, I want to get one of those buses. I'm not sure if it works, but we'll still leave it right there. Oh, I found some jellyfish. It'll be fun to get some of these around. I kind of want to spread them around the map, all around the streets. People will have to look out to where they're driving. No one wants to get stunned by them. Since this is the literal spawn area for everyone, 
We should put something up here so everyone knows what game this is. I actually found the whole SpongeBob logo. The only problem for me is that guy up there. Can we delete him? Awesome! That actually looks pretty great up here. I'll even put that on the other side. Nice! That's looking pretty good. Dude! I found something kind of weird. It's the characters of SpongeBob, but very weirdly Robloxified. SpongeBob is just looking weird. Patrick isn't even star-shaped, just looks like a regular Roblox character. Here we have Squidward and Mr. Krabs, which look odd. Then there's Sandy and Gary. I really don't like these models. So away they go. You guys remember the paddy wagon? I found it for us to use. Look at it right here. We gotta have it on our map. It's such a cool vehicle to have. Up the hill of the neighborhood, I want to get this rocket. I'm not sure it does something, but it looks pretty good. We just have to make it a lot bigger. Right in front of SpongeBob's house, we're gonna give him a boat. It'll look great in here. I don't think it's functional though, but we'll see about that later in the video. Dude, what's this thing? Oh, it's King J jellyfish i remember the episode of this one it's so good i think it'll be great to have him over here just for his status finally we found some good character models we have mrs puff plankton everyone looks good just patrick seems a bit squashed let's delete those weird ones we'll be using these ones from now on i'll just put spongebob right in front of his house gary with him of course mrs puff is gonna be towards the school as we'll see later now i want to finally change the fountain and spawn to this pixel spongebob this one looks pretty nice i like him a lot so we'll leave him right here right next to spongebob's house we gotta get patrick's as well we couldn't leave one without the other they're the best of buds i think it's good right there we also have to get squidward's house since it is one of the most important buildings we have in this town. Squidward may be a party pooper and get mad at the guys, but deep down you know they're friends. Now look at how nice this looks. I think I'll get rid of the diner. In its place we'll be getting the Krusty Krab. This is for sure one of the most important buildings we gotta add. And it even comes with its own sign. We just gotta put it right over here. Dude, look at the inside. It looks just like it. We can even see the other rooms inside of it. It's someone says this looks bad they're straight lying we should put some character here like squidwards since he's the cashier and we should also get spongebob to work the grill keep up the good work bob i'll even get patrick to help him out you can do it patrick i believe in you getting back to the houses we still have some stuff we gotta add in this case sandy's house we can't not have her dome of a house even more since she is one of the main characters from the show i think right there is good our little the spongebob community is growing let's get you right in front of your house girl and let's get everyone in their rightful place so Patrick is going to his house. Let me just unsquash him right quick. Now he looks better. Mr. Krabs is gonna be right in front of his restaurant in case Plankton starts scheming again. Talking about Plankton, we should get the chum bucket too, right? I think we'll get them all out of the way so we can place it there. So here's the chum bucket. This guy just looks so well done. Let's get out guy Plankton right here. Oh, he's too big. Let's change that and put him right in the front door. Look at how good Good this already looks we can't forget to get karen as well for those that don't know that's plankton's wife and she's a lot bigger than him now just for the last i'm gonna put strong spongebob over here i'll also get some references to other episodes around the map like this very sad one from when he loses gary we'll also get this thing which is pretty dangerous which is killer bob there's even buttons to open his cell up but think about that first he's pretty dangerous Dude, what kind of Spongebob is this? You guys gotta see this one. I've never ever seen anything like this before. But we'll leave it right there just because it's funny. Here next to Spawn, we'll get some works for you guys to be able to turn into the characters. You just have to get on top of the circle and you should turn into it. Right next to the rocket, we'll get that boarding school where Mrs. Pop teaches. Let's put it right there. It's kinda out of the style we were going for, but it's better to have it than not. We should put Mrs. Puff in here too. Wait, what just happened to her? Let me change that one for the better model, because that one one's more accurate check out this boat that sandy's got we have to hope that we can drive this one whoa it's king neptune let's get him beside king jellyfish they are having some kingly talks so now i think there's nothing else i can add to our map here we are at spongebob brookhaven 
So let's test it all out and see if this one's good or not. There are some people that talk about my map saying how the regular Brookhaven buttons don't work in everything. The only thing that just kind of works is the avatar editor. And even that just takes us to this screen, nothing more. That basically happens because I don't have access to the scripts of the menu from Brookhaven. So that's why the things that work are just what's on the actual map, not on a menu. But whatever, let's do some tests around and see if this one's worth it. At the start we have the voxel Spongebob, which I really like, but it is kind of bizarre. I have to say that. Oh yeah, we got all these morphs for us to turn into the characters. So, can I turn into Spongebob? Uh, uh, no, I don't think it's working. You gotta be kidding that these are not usable. Oh gosh, what's happening to the paddy wagon? It's going crazy. It doesn't let me control it. Guess we got a crazy car into our map in the end. It's just gonna stay bugged like that. It literally doesn't stop moving around. So here we have the chum bucket with both. Wait a minute, what happened to Plankton? The guy was just fully disassembled. Sadly, we can't go into it. We at the very least have Karen's company. Oh gosh, what was that? Did she push me? What is this thing? Why does she do that? I'm not even sure it's her. I'm just being pushed away as I jump. Yes, we shouldn't jump anymore. And here we have the good old Krusty Krab. Mr. Krabs, I'm gonna go into your restaurant. I'll give you some money later, since I know you like it. Wait a minute. We can't get into it? You gotta be kidding me. Let's try to bug into it. It's not working. At the very least, we can use the camera here to have a look around this place. That's the menu with the Krabby Patties and other stuff. Seems delicious. Here's Squidward. He doesn't seem to be enjoying himself. But here we have some that are enjoying themselves. As Patrick and Spongebob are working as cooks. This looks really cool. I really wanted to be able to get inside this place. Dude, this car has to be possessed or something. Oh gosh. Wait, is the car the one that's pushing us? Here we have the bus. It's just decor, but it looks pretty good. We also have this boat. Oh gosh. Dude, like that is just difficult to do anything. Let's just go uphill. Hi, little jellyfish. And here we have our nice little neighborhood. We got jellyfish. The weirdest Bob ever seen. There's even Sandy's boat, which looks awesome. Dude, I really wanted to test it out, but this pushing thing doesn't let me. Okay, I got it. Now we can finally see if this one's good or not. Bonk! It's a good enough vehicle. Here we have Patrick in his house. Then we have Sandy in her house. I really wanted to go in, but it doesn't let me. All of this looks really good, but I would love to be able to get into his house. But this one is just fully hollow. It's really just for decor. There's King Neptune, but I don't know why he's like that now. Beside him is King Jellyfish. Neptune, your crown fell. Killer Bob, let me let you out. You can just go around and do as you please. Here we have, oh gosh, what happened to Squidward? I hope he's alright. Sadly, we can't go into his house either. To be real, I really like this map. I feel like it's better than that other one for me. I guess that Bob is going to church. Good for him. Also up the hill we have this big old rocket that probably doesn't do anything. I'll even get my camera inside so you can see that it's just hollow. Here's Mrs. Puff. Hope you're doing well. Well, there's something weird here that I don't know how it happened. Does something change if I click this? I guess not. But this is the boating school. We got a little class space inside for the students. Pretty simple, but it does work. The other other stuff I added I'm going to leave for you guys to discover. Now for you to play in this Spongebob map, you gotta find my Roblox profile, which is at NandaYT. Go ahead and follow me as well, so you can join into public games whenever I'm in them. If we go lower, you'll find my Roblox group, so you can become a member, because inside of it you'll find the games I've been making. Some of them even have gotten deleted. But you can find this latest one in the Experiences tab. So guys, that's gonna be it for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Watch one of the videos on screen right now. They're burger flipping good. Leave a like on the video and write in the comments some ideas for the next maps we can do. Don't forget to subscribe for more content just like this. Have a good one.